Go ahead. Somebody's mother. The woman was old and ragged and gray and bent with the chill of the winter's day. The streets were wet with the recent snow and the woman's feet were aged and slow. She stood at the crossing and waited long, alone, uncared for, amid the throng of human beings who passed her by, nor heeded the glance of her anxious eye. Down the street with laughter and shout came the boys like a flock of sheep hailing the snow piled white and deep. Past the woman, so old and gray, hastened the children on their way, nor offered a helping hand to her, so meek, so timid, afraid to stir, lest the horse's fate or the carriage wheels should crowd her down on that slippery street. At last came one of the merry troop, the gayest lad of all the group. He paused beside her and whispered low, I'll help you across if you wish to go. Her aged hand on his strong young arm she placed. And so, without hurt or harm, he guided her trembling feet along proud that his own were firm and strong. Then back again to his friends he went, his young heart happy and well content. She's somebody's mother, boys you know, for all she's aged and poor and so. And I hope some fellow will lend a hand to help my mother, you understand. If ever she's poor and old and gray, and her own dear boy is far away, and somebody's mother bowed low her head in her home that night, and the prayer she said was, God, be kind to that noble boy who is somebody's son and pride and joy.